then drop them doors. I know what you are. What's up, y'all? It's Kayla. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel if you are new. Well, I know y'all y'all see the you know the bonnet. I know it's looking crazy, but it's like seven o'clock at night, and I'm doing like the heatless curls, which stay tuned for that video. It might be up before this video. So yeah. I'm going to be doing my it. I can't even talk already. I'm going to be doing individual lashes for the very first freaking time. So I just got these individual lashes from Shein. Sheen. I keep saying Shein. It's Sheen. It's Sheen, right? Yeah. Okay. It, it, it looks like it's pronounced Shein. But anyways, I got these from Sheen. Um, this one is Happy Butterfly. That's the name of it. And this one is called Magpie? Magfly? I don't know. What's that word? Fly. Magify? Okay, anyways. This one is like thicker or more fuller than this one. Um, I just typed in natural looking individual eyelashes because I like the natural look. So got these from Walmart. This is the Ardell brand. This is actually the medium black, not free naturals. I don't know which one I'm gonna be using yet. Okay, so I got this duo lash glue and my sister used it already and she said it, that it works really good. It's the, um, yeah, this kind. Oh, what the fuck? I thought it was gonna be bristles, but it looks like this. I'm gonna have my sister decide which ones I should use. I also got some tweezers too. But um, one thing I can tell you is it would be better if y'all was to use clear lash glue because if you that dries use, clear, yeah, it dries clear, and if you use the black, it's just gonna dry black, and it's not gonna look as good. It's not gonna look as like natural. Natural. So I'm gonna try to get um up close and personal as possible with my mirror right here. So yeah, I'm just gonna tell you guys what i'm going to be doing like with the first like, like a two over. strips or whatever and then i'll just you know speed up the clip so you guys can watch me do it or whatever mm -hmm. i'm just going to put like the fuller ones down here and then as we come up here i'm gonna go in with the these ones okay we're just gonna see how that goes basically it's freestyling so yeah freestyling out. it and see how it comes out oh it has numbers it's okay so it's like nails like it has numbers like 13 11 9 so i could use just you know one one thing shit i don't even know y'all like what but this one don't have numbers it's like all the same size i guess we're gonna go in with the the thirteens at the end. Oh my God, I already done broke that one in half. I'm going to be doing it this way, up under my eyelash. I'm not gonna put it on top. I'm gonna put it underneath. Okay, so I'm just dipping it. That's how it looks, you know. Let it get tacky, and it's slipping off. Oh shit. I need to get better tweezers, okay? Don't come for me. Okay, the first one is on. That was easy, oh my goodness. That was so easy. Ooh, that's long. Let's keep going. So that is three so far. This one looks like it's not sticking. Oh, I knew it wasn't sticking. 
don't be shy to put more glue up there if it's not sticking then put more glue Okay, so I did notice that they are numbered. This is 13, 11, and 9. It all kind of makes sense now while I start, you know, doing them. So I'm going to go in with, like, the middle lashes. I'm going to go in with the 11s. All right, y'all, so this is how it looks so far. It looks so good. Just make sure that you get it super close to the lash line as possible. I do not feel anything. It feels super natural. It feels like there's literally nothing there. And I love it so far. So let's keep going. But now I'm going to go in with the number nine up here at the top. So it is like a little shorter, I think. But that is the look that I'm going for, like right here, towards the inner part of my eye. So I think one more should fit up here. Girl, so this looks so good so far. So this is this side. And then it's the bare side. But look how good it looks. Oh my God, that looks so good. And it feels so good. I don't feel nothing and it looks good. Okay, so let's move on to this eye and then we'll see how the whole thing looks when I'm done. Okay, so this is what it looks like. This side was much easier than this side, as y'all can tell. It's not really lined up straighter, like straight like this one, but it still looks really good for my first time. Also, this took me like 40 minutes to an hour. Um, I would say that it's a lot easier for me, in my opinion, to apply these than the strip lashes. I don't know why, but I just really like the individuals better. And it looks better too. Yeah, now my sister wants me to do her eyelashes. So I'm going to do a before and after picture or a little clip of her eyelashes when I'm done. I will also put the link to the eyelashes that I got from Shein down below for you guys. If you guys were interested. I got these for like literally like two, three dollars. And they were, and they work really, really good. So highly recommend. Highly recommend. 10 out of 10. Ew. 10 out of 10. Here's my sister. Ew. But yeah, let me know down below if you guys want any more videos like this. Let me know what you guys think. Make sure that you guys go click on my social medias down below. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace. 10.30 morning.
Drop them drawers, I know what you are I ask myself, is this shit real? 